What's going on everybody? This is Steve with the Mr. Big Kid channel. Thank you all so much for watching and thank you all for tuning in. My absolute favorite type of video to film and that's going to be an armor test. This is a level four armor plate made by Safe Vest. A little disclaimer, I did not get this armor plate for free. I did have to pay for it. However, in order to do this testing, I did receive a discount when I purchased it. Either way, I love filming these videos. They're fun and this is what we're gonna test out today. A level four plate armor should be able to withstand a 30 out six armor piercing round. I have a 30 out six with me today. I just don't have armor piercing 30 out six rounds. So we're gonna hit it first with a 30 out six. The reason I wanna hit it with that round first is because we wanna test the rating. We wanna test to make sure it can withstand up to its rating. Granted, it's not armor piercing. Then what we're gonna do is we're gonna hit this with a 5.56 full metal jacket, a 5.56 green tip. We're gonna finish it up with the 50 BMG full metal jacket and if things are permitting, maybe even the 50 BMG API. One thing to note, this does not have any metal component. This is a ceramic and PE fiber plate. So that's what we're gonna shoot. First things first, let's get the 30 out six tested out. And if you haven't already, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. The Mr. Big Kid channel is all about firearms and barbecue. I love to do them both. So if you guys love firearms and barbecue as well, I would highly recommend you guys subscribe. Anyways, let's get started. Level four plate test now. So that's the 30 out six hole right there. It did stop it, but quite a bit of deformation. But sure enough, it took the impact. Let's hit it with the uh, 5.56 now. Six hit and it did stop it again we have another deformation in the back but sure enough it stopped the 5.56 and 30 on six Well, it did not go through. And it actually looks like it hit it in the same hole too. We did crack the water bottle, but I mean, it's, it's just cracked. It didn't go through. I mean, no doubt this thing's hitting with some kinetic energy, but so far it stopped the 30 out six, five, five, six, and the green tip. So you know what? Let's go for the 50 BMG.
Well guys, 50 BMG did not stop <laughs> the level four plate, did not stop the 50 BMG, but that was cool. Yep, that thing's taking a beating already. Look at that ceramic plate right there, that's super thick. I'm gonna put it upside down. I'm gonna try to hit it with the API still. So, hopefully it'll stay. BMG API armor piercing incendiary. Oh, that was a good hit. <laughs> Again. sign out i've been waiting for like 10 minutes for the wind to die down it's just not doing it remind me to invest in a lavalier microphone i used to have one lost it this is what happened to it 50 bmg uh definitely went through the armor you can see i'm guessing this is api it's a little kind of looks a little burnt whereas this is the well they look about the same actually i think i have no idea what hits what Cool collection, another another piece of broken armor to add to my collection. It did stop 30 out six, stopped the 556, and it stopped the 556 green tip. Um, sorry, but I could not shoot the 762 today. My optic completely went out and I am completely out of time. So I decided I want to go for the 50 BMG. That's probably what you guys really wanted to see, anyways, considering the title of this video. But yes, this did stop what it's supposed to stop. So I will say this level four armor by Safe Vest does stop what it's supposed to stop. And it is truly level four. It seems really well built. And I'm excited to look at the footage and look at some of the slow motion to see how it really came out. But um, lots of different layers, fiber weaves, uh, ceramic plates. And um, man, it's, yeah stuff well there you have it if you guys like this video please give me a thumbs up leave a comment in the comment section below don't forget to subscribe to my channel the mr. big kid channel I am all about firearms and barbecue I love them and that's what I do if you guys make body armor and want me to test it feel free to shoot me an email Steve at mr. big and uh, don't forget to subscribe hit that bell notification icon guys I will see you I'm so sorry, but I totally forgot to hit it with the 4570. This is the Marlin 1895 SBL, and I'm shooting a 350 grain, 2000 FPS projectile. Let's go ahead and hit it a couple times. Sorry, I forgot to do it before the 50. I was just too excited. But I don't want clickbait. That's what I don't